Chris, thank you. Now to Spartanburg County, where Sheriff Chuck Wright held a press conference this evening after a narcotics investigation he said led to guns, drugs, and money being taken off the street. Our Rashad Williams is joining us live in Spartanburg County with a look at the operation. Rashad, what did the sheriff have to say? Well, Sheriff Wright said this operation that you just mentioned all started with a simple tip from someone in the community. And let's go ahead and show you for yourself. Here's what that tip led to. Two simultaneous search warrants that were executed yesterday at two neighboring homes on Marion Street and Calpins. Now, 41-year-old Stephen Quinn and 39-year-old Rebecca Quinn were arrested. Both of them are convicted felons, but 22 firearms were found in their home. Sheriff Wright says the two initial search warrants also led them to a storage facility that was under Stevens' name where nearly 40 guns were found, making it 60 total firearms that were seized in this operation. The narcotics units gathered 89 grams of methamphetamine, 459 grams of marijuana, 14 oxycodone pills, 22 firearms from the house, two stolen firearms, one stolen enclosed trailer, and one stolen vehicle dolly, and $16,923 cash. And that is a long list. Sheriff Wright also spoke about gun control, saying it should not impact law-abiding citizens, but rather should apply to those who are involved in criminal activity and those who simply misuse firearms. Now, some of the guns were also with, quote, obliterated serial numbers, and Sheriff Wright said some of the guns were being sold to drug cartels. Now, we know that Stephen and Rebecca Quinn, uh, they both faced a long list of charges. They also had bond hearings that we were just made aware of uh, later on this afternoon or earlier in the afternoon, excuse me. Um, we know that Stephen was denied bond and Rebecca's bond was set at $30,000. Live in Spartanburg County, Rashad Williams, WYFF News 4.